You know what you are. Your skin is pale white and ice cold. You don't go out into the sunlight. Say it out loud. Say it. Vampire. Well, you've got teenage girls, you've got middle-aged women, you've got grandmothers <laughs> losing their mind over this story. Now, why do you think, you know, Twilight has become such a phenomenon? I wish I could answer this question. <laughs> I really wish I could get asked it so much. I have no idea. Are you afraid? No. It's just a really effective, dire love story. And it's scary. It's like this impossible, really difficult love story. I think that people are just dying for that kind of connection, that you know, like a really profound, like true love, you know. And if it's with a bad boy and it's dangerous, even better. <laughs> <laughs> there must be something about Edward Cullen that is that I still have not realized what it is, but um, uh, that all women seem to want as their perfect guy. I mean, who would have thought the perfect guy would? Drive a Volvo. What if I'm not the hero? What if I'm the bad guy? Tell me about the audition process. I mean, did you have to go through a bunch before you got to the point of... No, I think they were getting desperate. I mean, I <laughs> literally, like, I did one audition. I got the part, like, the next week. So I mean, that was the audition at, at, at Catherine's? Mm-hmm. With Kristen? Yeah. And they came over to my house with Kristen, and then we did all these, like, different auditions, a bunch of different scenes, and the person that really had that connection with Kristen was Robert. He looked terrified and afraid, yeah. just and 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 pained, um, and that was right. I just feel like he understood the character. I only said it'd be better if we weren't friends. Now that I didn't want to be. What does that mean? It means if you were smart, you'd stay away from me. Stephanie on her website's telling people to bring paper bags to the movie. Why to throw up? No. <laughs> The audience might hyperventilate because of the chemistry. I found out that some of the earliest vampire movies, they would have a nurse stationed in the theaters in case people fainted. What is going on? Security guard at the mill got killed by some kind of animal. Did you have an inspiration? I had read something about Fonzie and Clooney or something. <laughs> Playing Edward. Why did I say that? <laughs> you know, I'm just, you know, I'm just asking. I just, I, you know. <laughs> the thoughts of George Clooney. That's funny. <laughs> no, Clooney um, probably be pumped up about that. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Is it true that you already have Twilighters hanging outside your uh, your apartment? It was true for a while. Yeah. Yeah. I got notes on my car all the time, saying like, "Listen, I'm not a weirdo, but but can you?" Can you just go out with me? <laughs> and it's like, wow. And then the next day I'd be like, I swear to God, I'm not a weirdo, but if you don't call me, I'll kill myself. <laughs> oh my <laughs> like, gosh. I mean, it was quite funny. You got a vibe of what the fans, I mean, how excited they were at Comic Con. Oh, oh. yeah. I mean, they told us too. They said, you know, we just want to like, like, but the, it was funny because they told us like it was low key. They're like, hey guys, we just want to give you a heads up. So, um, you know, there's a lot of people here, and, and some of them have been camping out, and you know, it's like 6,500, give or take. <laughs> <laughs> and we're sort of like, you know, like, oh, could you be so careful? You're like, we're putting the band back together. Uh, yeah, <laughs> no, seriously, yeah. And you and I wanted to go down there and meet him, and they were like, no, we don't have enough security. Yeah, they said we were naive because we wanted to go out and just be like, hey guys, and thank oh. them for being so supportive. And they were like, please do not go out there by yourself. Action! You better hold on tight, spider monkey. The very last shot, you know, where you see the helicopter going around, that is two stunt doubles. And okay. they are up there and scared to death because they were up really high and they were wired onto the tree, but when the helicopter went past them, it almost blew them off the tree. Are you nervous or are you excited about this hitting the big screen? A little nervous. Um, just hype which is it's always out of your control sure. I'm really excited because you know we've worked hard on it and I love what Rob and Kristen did in the movie so I want everybody to see it too Marker. Three, two.